Give me the bat. Give me the bat. Give me the bat. Come on. Hi everyone, welcome to or welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time here, my name is Matt. This is Jackass Retro. I am a full-time eBay reseller uh, operating out of Bremerton, Washington. And you've seen the intro, you saw the thumbnail. Uh, I'm about to embark on a 30-day challenge. Uh, I've wanted to do this a really long time, uh, but given the current conditions, now seems like as good of a time as ever. So, you read it right, 1,000 listings in 30 days. I'm going to start this midnight, April 1st. This is not an April Fool's joke. Um, we're doing this. So, uh, if you would like to join along, I'm not saying you should do 1,000 listings in 30 days. It's going to be different from every, for everyone. Uh, this is, for me, something I want to see if I can do myself. Uh, I think that there's going to be a lot of long-term benefit to doing this. Um, increasing my uh, online inventory by what probably about 15% so uh, I've been kind of raring to do this for a while but now that I'm locked in I think now's the time to do it however uh, I do have some rules so let's go over those so rule number one I make the rules uh, this is my challenge for me um, so you know what? I get to do this how I want. Which brings me to rule number two. Uh, transparency. I'm going to set up a uh, spreadsheet that I will share with all of you. The link to it will be down in the description. Uh, just a regular old Google Docs that you can go and uh, check out and kind of see my... Rule number three. In the interest of full transparency, uh, I have uh, about 115, 120 drafts that need photos. Um, I'm letting myself include those, right? Rule number five. Not really so much a rule, more of like a sub-goal. Um, or sub challenge, extra points, something like that. Uh, I'm going to try to source 5% of these listings. So 50 listings uh, are things I don't have now. I'm going to try to source 50 items and list those 50 items within the, this 30 day period. Part of that is not just a challenge for myself, but also a demonstration for a lot of new resellers or maybe some resellers out there who are discouraged that they're not able to get items from their normal sources. Uh, I will try to do some videos and be transparent as to where I'm looking for things and where I get those. Uh, the catch on this is if I get those items, 
I have to list them before I can list my death pile. All right, and rule number five. Uh, this is listings, not items. So multi-quantity listings don't count. If I've got, you know, 10 of a thing, it only counts as one list. There you have it. All right, rule number five. Listings, not items. So if I've got 10 blank VHS tapes that are all the same uh, and I list them individually, it doesn't count as 10 listings, it counts as one listing even though it's multi-quantity. So thank you very much everybody for watching. Uh, if you want to follow along, please subscribe to the channel. I will be providing updates regularly. Uh, there will also be the spreadsheet once again in the description down below that you can check in at any time at my progress. Uh, if you want to do a challenge yourself, um, you know, figure out what's right for you. I'd love to know what you're going to do. Um, leave a link to in the comments or just a, leave a comment. Uh, and maybe we could come up with a hashtag like a 30 day listing challenge. Yeah, I think that works. 30 day listing challenge. Uh, tag it, leave it in the comments, and uh, I'd love to hear what other people are going to do with their next 30 days since sounds like we're going to be kind of stuck here for a little while. So thanks again very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.